Hello there, this is the B2, and we're going to talk about Applied Energistics 2, specifically how to charge Certus Quartz automatically. That's right. So, when you get ready to upgrade your ME drives, your storage components, as you uh, progress further into AE2, you will need a large amount of charged Certus Quartz, and it is very difficult to find by mining. So therefore, you have to set up this guy here, which is the charging station. So instead of coming over here, um, now you have to hook power through the bottom of it. So let's let's get some power run to this guy underneath here. And uh, we'll throw the charging station right up on there. Now, instead of sitting here and feeding it these Certus Quartz, and then having to take it out as a charge service quartz and then doing it again and again and again and again and again you can actually automate this process so by using the import export buses and then a little bit of cabling we can make this happen so let's see what we can do here we'll need a cable here and here and here and then what we'll need is to bring the this will be the import huh, whoops this will be the import here we'll go ahead and recable that that's going to bring it away from the charging station back into or import it into the ME system. This export bus here we'll put on the machine. And so what we're going to tell it is to pull Certus Quartz out of the ME into this machine. And then once it charges, it's going to pull it to here and then it's going to take it back in. So look at we what we have here is one, two goes into here. And comes into three, which is this right here. See, it's not even using the top row right here. We can just smash that. It's not even using this top row. So if you want to just get rid of a couple extra cables, you can just take a look at your channels here. And then it's going to come back into here. And we're currently using five of eight. So that would be one, two, three, four, and five. So let's see how it works. We throw the crystal into here. Ooh, let's pull that out. We don't want to throw the crystal into there. What we want to do is we want to export the crystal into the machine, right? Oh, nope, that's the wrong way, B2. Come on. There we go. Into here. Nope, that's a charge, too. So let's go get some regular Certus Quartz out. thought that I had one. I did not. So there's a regular Certus Quartz. Let's go ahead and put that into the export bus and see what happens. And there it goes. The Certus Quartz comes out. It charges. It flips back into the ME system. You can see it pop out. Very quick process there. It charges. It pulls out. It pulls another Certus. So if I was to go into the ME system here and take a look, you can see how it's going to pull a number off of here and place a number into there. Let's wait for it to get one in here. There we go. See it click away? Very easy process to upgrade in the ME system. I tell you what, like you will spend a lot of time just doing them by hand, and this is a machine that you can set up early on to uh, pop them out. And usually I'll just let it run. Uh, anything that takes Certus will also take charged Certus. So it's not like if you run out, um, you're not going to... Uh, you know, hurt yourself on that. So anyway, this has been the B2. I hope you enjoy this series on Applied Energistics. Uh, we'll be back again probably tomorrow with another episode of Applied Energistics 2. Have a great day.